first rule of farming is close the gate. Second rule of farming is animals die. Um, then down the list, there's things like don't look up the row to see how far you have to go. Look down the row and see how far you've come. Canvas Ranch reflects my husband being an artist. He's a painter. It's like any kind of a painting. It evolved layer after layer after layer. Canvas Ranch is really a very diversified farm. Uh, everything here has multiple purposes. We have one fellow that helps us out part-time, uh, but it's Tim and I that are doing everything ourselves. Uh, so we really know the land, and we know what we are doing in terms of growing some incredibly delicious food for people. So in North in order to pass along some of this knowledge, I've been having workshops out here, and it started with lamb camp and sheep school. We don't do a formal apprenticeship program, but another thing I've done is to invite people out to help us out on the farm. Well, I'm really proud that six of the people that have come out here are now farming on their own. You know, everybody's got a story. We owned an advertising agency, and I did that for about 20 years. In 2000, my daughter was diagnosed with a brain tumor. She was my only child. Uh, she was 12 years old, and 10 months later, she died. And afterwards, I realized I just want to be out there and experiencing what life is all about. But just being in the dirt and working the soil and all of that hard work was really healing. It still is. And I think what Deborah does is she really gives it the nurturing. I give it the reality. I'm a builder, I'm a designer, I'm a creator. So it really takes both of these efforts uh, to make a place like this come alive. It is, it is endless. And that's the trouble with living here. The canvas has <laughs> no, no edge. edge. <laughs> it's good.